What's up? Yes, we've got we've got OB jackets. That's my name on on the on the back. There are four right now. Only four in the entire world. So uh, welcome back to OB News. It's now OB News, not OB Gaming or Movie News because uh, I don't want to mix them. Uh, I mean, there are, we do a lot of stuff. So instead of just separating videos, four different news things I mean, let's just put them up in a video and we'll divide up on movies and games that's how we'll we'll do man the, my life the lighting is pretty awesome so let's talk about the news for today first news of the day rogue one trailer hits tomorrow thursday or thursday today if you're seeing this on thursday because i don't know when I'm, I'm even gonna upload this so the trailer will be out on thursday you can watch it on the link in the description it'll be right there we cannot put up trailers what do you want copyright I need to make money off this shit, guys. So you can click in the link and it'll send you right to the Rogue One trailer. I really want to see some... I really want to see some goddamn Darth Vader, man. So excited for that. Also in the news, Suicide Squad beats Civil War, basically, in Marvel in, in, in the box office. Uh, 14 million Suicide Squad in opening for a Tuesday. And Civil War, 13 million, you can see. So another news. There's the new Aquaman villain. It's Black Manta. He's a classic. He's basically this Iron Man on the sea. So we've also in Marvel stuff, uh, there's a new villain in Spider-Man Homecoming, and it's Michael Chernus. We already know that Michael Keaton plays the villain already. There are rumors that Michael Mando is playing Carnage, and yeah, Michael Chernus is playing the Tinkerer in the movie. Not much else has been said other than that this Orange is a New Black actor will be on the movie. Already this movie has a gigantic so I'm looking really forward for that. Also, kind of late news, Arrival, the new film by Denis Villeneuve is out. And my god, this movie looks incredible. You can go look at it in the description. It stars Amy Adams, Jeremy Renner, and Forrest Whitaker. And boy oh boy, it looks gorgeous. He's one of my favorite directors of this modern film. So, Ocean's 8 has got new members up in their list. So if you didn't know, Ocean's 8 is a female now driven movie. It'll star Anne Hathaway, Rihanna, Elena Bonham Carter, Mindy Kaling, Aquafina, I don't know if I'm saying that correctly, already to the addition of Sandra Bullock and Kate Blanchett. I personally think this is a interesting movie. I'll be watching it. Also, uh, if you didn't, didn't know, there, there is a World War Z sequel. Brad Pitt is producing it, but its director flew out of the sky. And the rumor is that David Fincher might actually be like this close to directing it. And I'm a hundred thousand percent excited for that because I thought World War Z was an okay movie. It was fun, but with the visual master perfection. Of David Fincher and Brad Pitt, man, that should be crazy good. Uh, it's not set in stone yet because Brad Pitt met up with a bunch of other directors, but he also met up with David Fincher. And it looks like first it was lukewarm, sort of, and now it's kind of taking off. And it might be David Fincher. There was also another rumor that David Fincher was doing another Ben Affleck movie, also. Uh, a remake of the Alfred Hitchcock movie uh, Stranger in the Train. Apparently that's not moving forward considering this or it has or it has been pushed back. You know? Also the Luke Cage trailer hit like a couple of days ago. Man, go check that out. It looks dope. I thought this series was had nothing going on for it. I mean Luke Cage was more like a side character for me. And this actually looks pretty pretty fucking awesome, so got to go check that out. Again, link in the description, go check that out. Gaming news, No Man's Sky was released yesterday and already two people found themselves, technically. Because they couldn't even see each other. So what happened was they arranged a meetup in one of the planets, which I don't know how it was done, because it, it's practically impossible to visit kind of the same planet I'm assuming as there are 15 quintillion planets on that game so I don't know how they did it but when they got to the same planet they couldn't see each other and it was a different day cycle looks like there are some debate regarding if this is a really multiplayer game or if they were really selling that they, that this was multiplayer just with the very slim chance of you meeting up with someone or is this actually single player and they use the uh, excuse that it was really 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 hard to find another person to sell 
as a sort of multiplayer, but it's actually a single player game, so it's kind of confusing right there. According to the uh, creators of No Man's, of no Man's Sky, it's a server issue because a lot of people were playing the game and it has been a huge hit. We're, we're thinking of buying the game and playing it up on the on this channel, so if you're looking forward to that, um, let me know. The Battlefield 1 game has a collector's edition, and it's $130. Uh, this sounds sweet, right? It comes with a little statue, you know, the guy you see shooting shit at the, uh, the screen in the box art. Yeah, well, you know what? It has no fucking game inside of it. Yeah, that's... Really smart move, uh, Battle, uh, Battlefield 1, or Origin, EA, you know, it doesn't come with the game at all. You have to buy that separately. But, you know, I'm wondering if this is real. I think this actually is a smart move. Because it may be that some people are, are going to be that stupid of buying it, that will cash money. And they'll have to buy the game on top of it. So I think it's a really smart move, maybe, uh, if, you're, if you're the devil's advocate. So that's it guys, that's it. Please subscribe man, go like, go share this shit. Go check please my main channel. There is where I put much of my soul in it. Uh, we make like little sketches and shorts. Some are funny, some are just like depressing sad shit. But go check it out man, it's it's really freaking cool. I, uh, yeah guys, so thanks for watching. New video tomorrow as always, new video every day basically. New video every day. So please, check it out, subscribe. Ah! Oh shit, I, my, 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 cam, my fucking lights almost went to hell. <laughs> yeah, subscribe.